Here we go then with this week's cardio and core workout. Three two minute sets each set. We have got two exercises, 30 seconds each, repeated round twice in that set. So warming up, little job on the spot. Just getting things moving. And then back and forth like that. off the neck and the traps. And then side to side. Really good. Okay, roll the shoulders back. Forward. Make sure we've got a comfortable stance, we're rotating from the hips as we go through, just a little bit further up onto the toe, that nice rotation round. more. Then we're going to take it down to the hips and knees up and down. Couple more. And then slightly wider squat stance and drop it down into a nice squat stretch. Really let it sink down, so stretch right around the quads, glutes, all over our body. In that nice position there. Really good, we'll bring it back up, and I'm jogging again. Heart rate just coming back up, ready to go. Punch it out to the front. Up to the top. Front again. And ready to go. So, first set, two exercises. We're going to start with option of toe tap plank or up that tempo with the plank jacks. Then bring it up into the jumping jacks and keeping that working round twice. So, to the tap, not too wide. Hold that core nice and strong, keeping that going. Or up the tempo into the plank jacks. Still keeping the hips down, still keeping the core strong. You can change between the two variations as you go through a set and as we go through the rounds. Straight in. Work it through. Back 
going in. So, plan jacks here, auto taps. Just try to keep moving. Okay, 30 seconds off between the sets. Alright, second set. Using the water bottle or something like that. I'm gonna pop that at the side. I'm gonna do a plank. Ah, reach under. Reach under. And then we're gonna keep it loose with the squat. Ah, up and down. Nice quick tempo air squats. to a plank, nice reach under, popping this across, make sure you're reaching under with the hand from the opposite side to where your bottle or another suitable object is. So we're making rotation, keeping the body strong. Just keep this movement going. Don't lock at the top. Just keep moving. Try and lock at the top anyway. Try and have the hips fully forward. The top of the squat. And nice continuous tension. Back down. In again. Across. Slow it down into the plank, into the core exercise. Focus on tightness and control of the core. Really good. Okay, third set. With all that an object again, slight lean back and rush and twist the course. The feet might come up a little bit to balance. Wanna have a little bit of that. And then first time round, mountain climbers, back to the rush and twist. Then we're gonna stand up for the high knees to finish. Here we go. It's a real struggle and do something like knees to chest, in and out, or even hold single knee, single knee. Just a couple of variations so you can keep going. First on, and we go for mountain climbers. Hips down, core tight, powering through. A good tempo. Very 
and again, Russian twist. to finish this round. There we go, take your 30 seconds or so off and in for another two rounds, three sets per round, nine sets in total for the cardio and core workout. Tap, not too wide, hold that core nice and strong, keeping that going, or up the tempo into the plank jacks, still keeping the hips down, still keeping the core strong. You can change between the two variations as you go through a set and as we go through the rounds. Straight in. Work it through. Back down and in. Jacks here, auto taps. Straight, keep moving. Oh, come. Here we go. Okay, 30 seconds off between the sets. And second set, using the water bottle or something like that. I'm gonna pop that at the side, I'm gonna do a plank. And reach under, reach under. And then we're gonna keep it loose with the squat. And up and down, nice quick tempo, air squats. Up to a plank, nice reach under, popping this across, make sure you're reaching under with the hand from the opposite side to where your bottle or another suitable object is. So we're making rotation, keeping the body strong. Squats to keep this movement going. Don't lock at the top, just keep moving. Try and lock at the top anyway. You can have the hips fully forward at the top of the squat. And nice continuous tension. Back down, in again. 
again. Reaching across. And slow it down. Lean into the plank, into the core exercise. Focus on tightness and control of the core. Really good. Okay, third set. With all that an object again, slightly lean back and rush and twist across. The feet might have come a little bit to balance. Wanna have a little bit of that. And then first time round, mountain climbers, back to the rush and twist. Then we're gonna stand up for the high knees to finish. Here we go. a real struggle and do something like knees to chest in and out or even hold single knee single knee just a couple of variations so you can keep going first on there you go from out and climbers hips down core tight powering through a good tempo to finish this round. So, to the tap, not too wide. Hold that core nice and strong, keeping that going. Or up the tempo into the plank jacks. Still keeping the hips down, still keeping the core strong. You can change between the two variations as you go through a set and as we go through the rounds. Straight in. Here. 
auto taps. Just try and keep moving. Okay, 30 seconds off between sets. And second set, using the water bottle or something like that. I'm gonna pop that at the side, I'm gonna do a plank. And reach under, reach under. And then we're gonna keep it loose with the squat. And up and down, nice quick tempo, air squats. to a plank, nice reach under, popping this across, make sure you're reaching under with the hand from the opposite side to where your bottle or another suitable object is. So we're making rotation, keeping the body strong. Anyway, we're going to have the hips fully forward at the top of a squat with nice continuous tension. Back down, in again. Reaching across. Slow it down into the plank, into the core exercise. Focus on tightness and control of the core. But we're coming in again. Let's go through. Really good. Okay, third set. With or without an object, again, slight lean back and rush and twist the corps. The feet might come up a little bit to balance. Like, have a little bit of that. And then, first time round, mountain climbers, back to the rush and twist. And we're going to stand up for high knees to finish. Here we go. a real struggle and do something like knees to chest in and out or even hold single knee single knee so a couple of variations so you can keep going first on and we go for mountain climbers hips down core tight powering through a good tempo Oh, 
Come on. I need to finish this round. So stretching off out to the front. Nice upper back stretch. Then hands round, chest up, elbows back. Nice chest to the front of the shoulders, delt stretch. Lifting everything up nice and tall, really good posture. Cross, bring that round to Kitten, stretch it round the shoulder. And round to the other side. Of our body then. Small step forward, reaching down towards the toe. If you can reach it, just reaching it down. So I'm going to stretch down the hamstrings and the calves and back of the legs. Spare hand, spare weight on the opposite knee. Then swap it around. There. Nice squat stance, nice width, stretching right down again, letting our body weight just drop down, and this time a little bit of tension now onto the knees so we can get the adductors on the inside of the legs stretched right round into the glutes as well. Great work.